Buonasera signore e signori. Good morning ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the delayed flight. Welcome to the channel once again. The most wonderful bespoke airport so far is this in Lugano. There is quite some job done here and uh, we will have a look at this airport which is amazing indeed. So first place to... Oh no, crash. You see, crash. Oh no, crash, crash, crash. Hello ladies and gentlemen. We've watched uh, a short time ago a crash in uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator. We don't have only the dreadful floating, but we also have the dreadful crash. And sometimes this can be quite common. So, uh, what you can do about it? The only solution I found is this one that I will show you right now, okay? I suppose you have a flight recorder. There is a flight recorder inside the game. Uh, it appeared uh, not long time ago with, uh, with an update. But it is not reliable and actually this flight recorder also crashes lots of times so I don't use it. I suppose that you may have another one. If you want me to show you how I installed mine please let me know but anyhow here is my flight recorder. After the crash we open the flight recorder. If you want any advice, please let me know and I will show you how. Okay, here it is. Here is the flight recorder. This can be very useful for two reasons, because if you have a crash during a flight, I suppose that you must restart and uh, you have lost your flight. If you have a crash uh, being uh, in an airport, again you must restart. The truth is that anyhow you will restart, but uh, how you will avoid uh, flying the same flight again or making the adjustments that you did in the airport again. So here is the solution how. For instance, now we had a crash in Lugano. Okay, We go to Lugano again. It was not this the airplane. It was on uh, as far as I as, as far as I remember. You will put the same uh, airplane that you had because otherwise, uh, when you will uh, restart with the flight recorder, you will have another. So we go and we find an eye again. The truth is that uh, this uh, airplane I parked in a specific place in front of the tower, so I don't want to start, let's say, from the runway or from the gates, but I want to find my plane where I left it. I mean where I left it before the crash, isn't it? So first we go to the airport where we were, and that was Lugano. Okay, we will go here. Or if we are airborne, we go to an airport which is nearby. If for instance we had a crash, and we were flying above Lugano. Here is also Malpensa somewhere here close. We go to one airport uh, nearby, either to Lugano or to Locarno is here or to Malpensa because that way uh, the simulator will load the graphics that we had. Okay, so I chose again Lugano airport. Here we are again ready to fly okay i can turn off the engines control shift e and now we bring the window of the, of our flight recorder okay i suggest this one it is i think one of the best and i have saved a very short clip with my location so I go load and I go to Logano. And it is a clip, let's say, about less than one minute. So I press replay. 
here. You see? And then stop replay. Here it is. So I am exactly where I was before the crash. I close the window. If we have a look, here we are. We were somewhere here. And uh, here is the tennis court. Here it is. Somewhere here we had a crash. So I can continue from this point my clip, my flight, my departure, whatever. You just need to save from time to time recordings, less than one minute, just to let your flight simulator, Microsoft Flight Simulator, load the same scenery again. If you were airborne, you would do exactly the same and you would stop the flight recorder during the flight and you would continue your journey. So this is what I wanted to show you. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments and I can uh, show you how to install this flight recorder that I have. This is not, of course, uh, the best solution, but it is uh, better than worse. Because like this, you can continue your flight. Thank you for watching this short clip and hope to see you soon. Bye for now.